Uh, Bud played fantastic. Uh, you know, made a lot of plays in the run game, but also had great pass rush. Um, was uh, was there when we needed him. Played through pain. And, you know, we had two two uh, things that were ailing him, and just tucked it out. Every single snap, I'm very proud of his efforts. There was a lot of different things that. It, um, that it takes to be a good defensive end, but you know, you've, you've got to be effective uh, pass rusher, but you also have to be effective in all those quarterback and, and um, spread run games. A lot of those teams pick on the defensive end and <coughs> try to get them up the field and then cut off them, and so you got to be able to, to be able to play both those types of games. Alabama State's a team that has some offensive weapons. What do you see from them? Who you have the game plan for? Um, well, Isaiah Crowell's uh, a great player. Um, we recruited him when we were at Florida State, so um, he's dynamic, and you can't let him get loose. You got to make sure that you keep him contained, and then when you got a chance to tackle him, you got to tackle him. When you look back at those third downs on that last drive, what did you see on video, and how frustrating was it uh, when you couldn't get him stopped there? Well, the last one we stopped him, and uh, yeah. it was very <laughs> exciting. Uh, um, and we gave him all back That's at, true. The, uh, at the 45 to the offense, and um, so. We, you know, we were pleased with the efforts on that last one. The other ones, um, we had our chances. You know, um, could have made some plays. In hindsight, could have called some things different. You know, but uh, that's always the way you are as a coach. You always look back. Um, but um, our players were, you know, excited to, to, to stop them at the end and, and give us a chance to win. It. Mark said yesterday he was talking about trying to develop some team toughness. Can you teach that? Is that a coachable thing? Um, I think that, uh, you know, you just emphasize a, a tough mentality in practice and you don't accept it when, you know, they're not physical play and practice and in the game and we harp on that. And so we just continue to, you know, celebrate those that play physical and then we continue to criticize those that don't play physical. Do you guys need those guys to play when they're hurt, when they're banged up a little bit, especially this time of year? Excuse me? Do you still need guys to oh, play through those injuries and be banged up even at this time of the year? How much do you still need those guys on the field? Even like a Bud Dupree. Even was a definitely, definitely, yeah. You know, we're thin, I think, as uh, Kentucky's been, you know. And so uh, we, uh, we, 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 we need everybody. You know, we, we, can't, uh, we can't lose anybody. If they get hurt, then, you know, it's going to affect us. You know, we, we have the next man up mentality, but we need everybody to play. What, what did you see out of Michael Douglas the other night? Mike played great. You know, I was really pleased with Mike. Um, Mike came in, and played a lot of snaps, and played a lot of, and made some plays. And it was technique sound, was assignment sound. I was very excited about. Yes, this is the first time since early September you were going to be favored going into a game. Did you notice your team prepare any different, or had a different feeling about them? No, no, no different. Uh, you know, one week at a time. We played uh, different types of teams all year, so. We just prepare the same way and, and uh, you know, make sure that we're uh, getting better every single day. How do you keep them from being overconfident when they're facing a favorite and, and kind of facing a team that, that maybe they, they think they should be doing? I think our guys are overconfident. You know, I think that uh, you know, we, uh, we, we, we look at what we can do better. We don't necessarily um, look at our opponent. We always harp on what we can do better. Is everybody good?